Hi guys, here's a quick video to show you how to find images that you can use for your projects in my class. Now, much like when doing a research project, you don't want to plagiarize. I don't want you to steal other people's images for your reports and other uses. So what I'd like you to do is go to search.creativecommons.org and what that allows you to do is search Creative Commons content, which is uh, people who have said that they are willing to let you use their things for free. Okay, Up at the top, type in what you're looking for. I'm going to do a search for Jupiter. Okay, And then I want you to click on the Flickr image search. What that does is it brings you to Flickr's website and it narrows it down to a number of images that you can use. And we're going to try this picture right here. And so we can click on that and it will open it in a new window. Once you get that new window on the right side, you will see the arrow with a bar underneath, which says download this photo. I want you to click on that and choose the size. Some of the original images are very large, so you might want to stick with something a little bit smaller, depending upon what you're using it for. Okay. So I'm going to scroll up just a little bit so that I can see the author's name here and the title. You can also see at the bottom left that it was downloaded, so I'm going to click Show in Finder. Okay. And it automatically highlights the image for me. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to rename it. Okay. The author called the picture my window to Jupiter. And it's by Jason Jenkins. Get it? I'm putting all of that information here. My Window to Jupiter by Jason Jenkins on Flickr. And that way I remember where it's from, but I can also cite it correctly. Okay? From here, I have a folder where I put all of my downloaded pictures in. So you can click and you can drag that up to downloaded pictures. And that is now in my folder. What I can then do is I can go into my presentation and I'm going to insert the picture. Okay? So insert image. And I'm going to upload it from my downloaded pictures file. Okay? And you can see where I have all the other pictures that I've downloaded before. And I can choose my window to Jupiter. And I will open that. and I have it here. Okay, You can resize it, you can play with it however you want. Now, the next step is an important one not to skip. You need to create a text box where you put in that same information that you saved it under the file. My window to Jupiter. And that was by Jason Jenkins. And I found it on Flickr. Okay, so now I have an image, and I like the picture, but I've also cited my source. Okay, you're not going to steal other people's research and data. We're not going to do that with pictures. Okay, and that's how you can use copyright-free pictures in 